Forget about manners. Today, let's talk about something practical. An AI workflow for content creation that you can start using right away. This structured AI workflow is built around 8 key modules, each one covering an essential step in the content creation process. Let me walk you through how it works. First up, ideation. Here, we use large language models. You can start by simply typing your initial thoughts at the prompt, but we have tips and tricks that helps collaborate with AI in an effective and efficient way. Next, copywriting. Again, we are using LLMs like ChatGPT and features like Canvas. You can edit the script smoothly, make adjustments on the fly, and keep everything flowing naturally. Now moving on to our direction. This isn't just about image generation. It's about understanding visual languages like style, color, and cinematography. AI tools like Midjourney can help generate keyframes for a storyboard, but having a strong foundation in visual storytelling is what really makes a difference. For the fourth module, we get into the first part of video generation, visual. Here, we experiment with text-to-video and image-to-video tools like Runway Gen3 and Clean AI. Prompt engineering plays a big role in getting the right look. And again, understanding cinematography, especially framing and camera movement, can make video generation much more effective. In the next module, we tackle talking heads videos. There are multiple ways to generate footage and lip sync. And in this module, we cross compare different tools like Hagen, Clean AI, and Runway Act 1. This is especially useful for UGC and personal branding videos. Even though AI can't fully edit a video for you yet, it can make post-production a lot easier. For example, we can use AI-powered transcription tools for quick text-based editing. Once the content is ready, we move on to publishing on social media. AI tools can optimize posts for engagement and tailor content for different platforms. As creators, we are aware of our concerns around copyright, data privacy, and misinformation that comes with AI-generated content. So this last module is about understanding best practices for using AI responsibly. And that's the AI workflow for content creation, the process I use every day. If you find this useful and want a deeper dive, you can check out the full breakdown on Gumroad. Hopefully, this gives you a starting point to integrate AI into your creative process. Thank you.